right. You're not listening enough. You're over budget, and that's your husband. Trudy Taylor! You're laughing. People in L.A. Um, don't laugh anymore. They can't. They have too much Botox. It's <laughs> do a joke in L.A. People are like, you are so funny. This was amazing. Please come back. Come to every conference we have. The AMA says, watch out for the symptoms of stress. Excessive eating, excessive drinking, not exercising, and excessive shopping. What are we talking about? This is my idea of a good day. Am I right? It's like... Like, come on, girls, let's skip the gym, chow down, get loaded, and shop. Judy was amazing. I was sweating. I was laughing so hard. Judy was awesome. She knows how to speak to the crowd. And you can't spell the word message without the first four letters. You can't spell message without a, a mess. And I have learned from such an early age the transformational power of turning that mess to a success by laughing at it. And when we learn to laugh at some of our problems, it transforms them. When we can laugh at a problem, it makes it more manageable. They say that comedy is tragedy plus plus time. You know, I want to show you today how to look at some of the issues you're dealing with the way a stand-up comic would, just like, like different. You could go like, oh, I get it. I'm not in a miserable marriage. It's comedy material. I'm not dealing with the residents from hell. They're hecklers. There's nothing you can't transform to comedy. Oh, I get it. My son was an arrested drunk on the TV show Cops. I have a relative in show business. Judy was phenomenal, so hilarious. And honestly, like I needed that lecture. I needed that little bit of comedy in my life right now.